Hello everyone, this is Pat Patsy here, and today I am doing an iPhone unboxing. So I ordered my iPhone 6, um, pre-ordered last Friday, and it came this morning. It is a 64 gigabyte model, um, the space gray one you can see on the back, 64 gigabyte. So this is the phone right here. So I'm gonna open it and show you guys the actual phone. So let me see, I got a pin. I don't want to hurt the box. I'm usually paranoid about that kind of thing. And I've got it. I've been really excited too. I really like the idea of the bigger screens and everything. So I've been waiting for this to come. And here it is. So the box I also kind of thought was interesting. It looks really clean and nice, obviously. Um, I just thought it was interesting that the cover didn't actually have a picture. Usually it's, you know, got some sort of picture. So let's open this. Okay. Oh, there it is. Oh, beautiful. So let me see. I'm on got a tab right there so you can pull it out oh man it feels really light it feels really light okay we'll, we'll just set that right there for a second um so let's see we've got this thing it's probably some start to guide thing even though they got that tips app added in ios 8 they might still add that how do these such a weird thing sometimes <laughs> the tabs are like let's see right there okay um so, oh, and I think these actually leaked this picture a while ago. So you've got your normal thingy that shows the basic buttons and layout of everything. That's just the, the kind of the tip sort of thing I was showing, talking about. Um, you've got a little Apple iPhone info sheet and, of course, your Apple stickers. Those things are always included. The stickers, always there. <laughs> so a lot of people really like those. And, of course, inside of the box, you've got the typical headphones that they've started to make, these new ones. I've actually never used them before, so I don't know how good they are. I've heard a lot of good and bad things about them. Mostly good, it seems like. Um, the in-ear ones, I can't remember what they call them, but they're, like, special. So, those are cool. Um, of course, the thing that plugs into the wall to convert your power and the Thunderbolt cable that comes inside of there. So, we've got all those major parts there and the phone itself, of course. So, the phone looks really nice and it feels really good, too. I mean, I've still got the plastic stuff on it, so I probably should peel that off. So you guys can see the the actual phone itself. Oh man, it, I love it. I think it looks beautiful. Some people, you know, had even said they don't really like the design a whole lot, but I really like it. I really think it feels comfortable. That feels really nice in your hand. And my hands are pretty big, so it may not look um, completely accurate to what it will be for you because I'm really tall, so my hands are kind of big, which makes it nice for me because I've always, I've always hated having such a tiny phone. You know, the iPhone 5, I love the phone, but it's really small. So, Sleep button's over here now on the side. I'm gonna I'm gonna turn it on for you guys. Oh sweet. So I, I don't know. I think they come loaded with some battery power. I don't know how much. Sometimes it seems like they come fully charged, and other times not quite. And I think during the shipping process and such, it actually um, loses some of its charge. And I've got my iPhone 5 here. It's actually recording this. So my my mom has an iPhone 5 as well. So I'll be recording another video for you guys comparing the two, the iPhone 6 with the iPhone 5 side by side soon so you guys can see the thinness of the phone and the actual size of the screen and everything so there it is booted up so the battery looks like it's almost full actually so quite nice looking english united states of course i am network okay well let me type this in um Okay, I think I've connected properly. I think I typed it in right. Our password's like crazy amount of digits, like 12 or something crazy. All right, I'll enable those for now. Set up as new phone. I'll skip the step of the Apple ID just so you guys don't have to wait for me to do that. The screen looks really good though. I like this. And the bezel's really small on the outside, so the screen is able to fill up a lot more. Um, we can set up Touch ID later. Let's see, continue. I'll go set up that stuff after we're done here. Um, I don't want one of these. Continue. Oh my goodness, just get me to the bloody screen. Uh, display view, standard or zoomed? Well, obviously I want standard. Crazy phone. Okay, finally, there we go. Well, here we are, you guys. This is the, this is the actual phone. Logged on and um, working. It feels really bad nice even the glass it's weird maybe i'm just an apple freak i don't know but it, it feels really nice to me um it even whoa wait one second allow weather sure it even says t-mobile and has the 
the bars, but I didn't... Oh, it has a card in there, probably. Probably shipped with a, a T-Mobile card. It's just not my card. So, I'll put that in there. But, anyway, so that's the iPhone 6 for you guys. This is just the 6. I don't know if I mentioned specifically. This is not the 6 Plus. Just the iPhone 6. Um, the 6 Plus is even bigger. Probably out to there. I think it's about an inch or two longer on the top. But I was happy with the iPhone 6 because I think it, look at that, it fits pretty nice in my hand and my hands are big. So I think the iPhone 6 Plus will be massive. But if you're looking for a new phone and you haven't upgraded for a while, I definitely would check this out and consider it. It feels really nice. Of course, I haven't used it very much. I just got the phone It's right now. Um, I haven't opened it or anything before this video. And the camera is supposed to be really nice. The whole phone just feels good to me. It feels really good holding it like this. I think it's going to be a great phone. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. And I'll see you in more iOS 8.